down the road will for decades, the issue of maintenance of public utilities and infrastructure has been one Nigeria has always berated successive administration and has led to many describe Nigeria as part of a nation without a maintenance culture. With this in mind, the federal government under the Buhari administration has launched a public infrastructure maintenance framework to address the issue. Minister of Power Works and Housing Babatunde Fashala said the new initiative will provide employment opportunities for more Nigerians. This is the new conference hall of the Ministry of Power Works and Housing, well equipped to cut costs and avoid wastage of money on event centers for its activities. <laughs> The countless number of damaged infrastructure facilities in public buildings reveal a poor maintenance culture. Gathered here as stakeholders of government agencies, representatives of the National Assembly, construction industry, and directors in the ministry to get firsthand the presentation of the Ministry of Power, Works and Housing Maintenance Framework created under this administration to keep infrastructure alive in the country. The policy trust proclaims that all public buildings will be maintained in a manner to preserve its value and to ensure that it serves the purpose for which it was built. The Minister of Power, Works and Housing, Babatunde Fashola, says the policy will be in line with the executive order five, while stating that maintenance is not just an act, it is also an economy. It is also meant to empower the middle class, those who are in small and medium scale enterprises, manufacturers of cottage industry produce equipment, those who make paints, who make nails, who make electrical fittings, wiring, and all of that. And generally drive the growth of Nigeria's economy. So, as we sit down here today, we're turning a new curve. We're opening a new chapter of economic prosperity. Stakeholders, including the head of service of the Federation, laud the policy while stating that it is a giant step in the right direction. With this clear and comprehensive sustainable maintenance policy, there is bound to be a lasting improvement in our maintenance culture as it will open a new chapter in the overall maintenance of public assets and facilities. I will be collaborating with you to define the level at which a work is satisfied under maintenance and where it moves into a proper work so that will be able to guide us during our budgetary process. This is going to save us a lot of resources, it's going to create a lot of jobs, and I want to join my colleague by saying that any responsible and responsive legislature will support this, and I'm assuring you, on behalf of the Committee on Works, we'll support it in every way we need to. The Federal Executive Council had on the 9th of January approved the National Public Building Maintenance Policy to ensure maintenance of public infrastructure and create economic benefits for Nigerians, especially the unemployed.